Mondays is Mindful Mondays. So I my morning message is take a few moments and just be. Sit in your silence and check in as to where you feel like you're angry or resentful or sad or suffering. And then the reflection is, what am I holding on to that's creating this suffering? You know, the Buddha teaches that all things in life are impermanent. And it's not just Buddha. It's even in, it's in all other religions as well, right? Um, the, the Midrash even says, you know, everything has an end. So everything in life has an end. The Buddha teaches uh, in his teachings of impermanence that everything is of the, the nature to be born, to have its journey, to die, and to be reborn again. So when we're suffering or when something's going on, we're holding on to something. And what is it that you're holding on to? Is it real or is it perceived? Is it, are you holding on to um, the past? What are you holding on to? And can you let go? It teaches you to let go so that whatever that phase was, whatever that thing was, it's allowed to have its ending. So that once it has its ending, you could also allow for the newness to come in. So not looking at an ending as a death per se, but just a entering into a new phase, look at it more positively as in what's new, what's great, that's to come. And that's what I've been resting in for the last 24 hours. My birthday was yesterday and it's a great birthday message too, right? That year, that number, everything that happened in that number, boom, gone. Now we're in a new one. I didn't die. I'm just in a new phase. So um, try to take on what you're going through today. Sit with it. Um, we we'll all have a little something in our heart, a little something in our mind that, that's really aching at us. And can you just take a moment and just, just let it go. And when it comes back in, continue to let it go. And guess what? Those glimpses of peace, they grow from a nanosecond to a few seconds to a few minutes, a few hours, days, and all of a sudden you've healed through it because you've let it go and you've realized that you're on the other side of it and everything that's coming is worth it. That's your mindful